Interprofessional collaborative communication is a very important aspect of providing quality of care. Oh, my, where's my stuff? Hey, Jackie. Hey, Debbie. How's it going? Pretty good. What's up? Yeah, good. I do. You have patient in room 13? So. Oh, What's up? okay. Well, I don't think she's doing very well. I think you should go do something about it. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. I'm trying to find her chart and give um, Dr. Green a call. Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, be careful when you call her because you can have an attitude. I know it's 3 o'clock in the morning. I'll we'll see. Good luck. I'm going to go hang this bag. Okay. Talk okay. to you later. Bye. Bye. Hello, this is Dr. Green. Hey, Dr. Green, this is Nurse Jackie calling from All Star Hospital. Um, you're going to have a patient here, right? Um, she's in room 13. I'm so sorry to know her name. So she uh, complained about short and deep breath and uh, chest pain. Uh, and also, the uh, respiratory therapist uh, updated me about eight hours ago saying the lung sounds were okay. So, what do you want me to do? What were her last vitals you took? Uh, well, I really apologize. I have not get a chance to go into her room to assess her. Um, but I think the CNA has her, you know, vitals and everything. Page CNA number one. Yes, who's this? Hi, um, this is Nurse Jackie. Uh, are you CNA number one? Yeah. Okay, come to the nurse station right now, please. This is urgent. Okay, Thank you. What's up? You call me? You're CNA number one? I am CNA number one. You have patient number 13, right? 13. I don't know who's 13. Um, I'm looking for her chart. You have her chart? Let me see. She's complaining about short little breath and chest pain. Wait, 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 slow down. 13 brown? I don't know. Stop asking me. I don't know what her name is. Okay, I think Did you take her vital signs? No, I didn't because I didn't have a chance. I was in the middle of putting a foley for someone. Oh my god, you're here to take vital signs, not here to insert the foley, okay? Can you please go do it now? This is urgent. Alright, okay. alright. Thank all right. you. See it, days. Lack of interprofessional collaborative practice can pose a great threat to patient safety, staff distress, tension, and efficiency. Hi, Jackie. Oh, hey, Debbie. How are you doing today? Uh, kind of busy. Oh, What's yeah. Up? I noticed you've been a little bit busy with your patient in room 13. Is yeah. everything okay? Yeah, so far so good right now. Yeah, I'm how about, are you? I'm about to call Dr. Green. Oh, okay. How yeah. are your other patients? Um, I think they're okay right now. Okay, you. if you need any help, please let me know. Oh, okay. sure. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Thank you. Nurse Jackie is going to use the S-Bar, an effective strategy to overcome barriers to improve communication. Hello, this is Dr. Green. Hey, Dr. Green, this is Nurse uh, Jackie calling from All Star Hospital. I am so sorry to call you this time. I know it's 3 o'clock in the morning. Uh, I do have a uh, situation that I want you to know. So, uh, one of your patients, Mrs. Brown, she's in our room 13. Do you remember her? Yes, I do. Okay, so she was admitted to our floor two nights ago for congestive heart failure exacerbation. Uh, she complained uh, about a shortness of breath and the lower extremity edema about 30 minutes ago. I did went into her room get an assessment down. So uh, she was tachycardic in the 120s. I heard crackles in her lungs. Um, I've been given all her Lasix on time but it does not seem to work. Would you please consider to increase her Lasix dosage? Yes, that sounds like a very good idea. Okay, uh, would you be able to write the order right now? Oh yeah, of course. Thank you so much, Dr. Green. Interprofessional collaborative communication improves the care of process for the staff and the patients.